Welcome everyone to the Winter Major Expert Division Qualifying Round, hole number one. Before we get into that, I'd like to ask everyone, please, if you're not subscribed to the channel, please do me a favor, hit the subscribe button. Absolutely free and uh, helps me grow the channel. You can also ring the little bell. You'll get notified when I go live or post new content. Appreciate all that I already have. Uh, four copies of these notes with all the additional tweaks and such. Uh, you can find those patreon.com slash gcfenzo. We have excellent notes for expert and master play. So um, if you're interested in winning some banners, come on over and check us out. Patreon.com slash gcfenzo. Also, if you'd like to hang out and become a member of the channel the link for that is in the description of the video members of the channel get access to first looks and you get to see all the dialing in process you get uh channel members also get access to many expert mini notes and other benefits you know highlighted chats and special emojis and such so it's very cheap it helps support the channel, helps keep me doing what I'm doing, and I sure do appreciate all the members. So if you'd like to become a member, you can find that link in the description of the video. Also, if you'd like to send a tip, you can find my PayPal link in the description of the video as well. So for hole number one, we have a base shot, and then I have it tweaked out to try and give you a better chance at the hole in one. We're going to be using a Kingmaker, APOC 5 plus. We're setting up at the top of the plus 12. So, APOC 5 and 6, you'll have one third of the red ring in the right rough. APOC 7 is red ring touching the right rough. And then APOC 8 is two thirds of the blue ring in the right rough. And that's all at the top of the plus 12. So the base shot here is 4.8 top spin, 1.2 left spin. That should always put you on the green and always give you a nice easy putt for eagle. Uh, if you're looking for the hole in one, you're going to need more tweaks. Uh, I'm not going to go over all the tweaks that's for guide members, but I will give you a couple of them. Um, here and I'm going to tell you the wind angles that I'm looking at right so that's the setup starting position what I'm doing is setting my starting position then I'm going to turn I'm going to adjust before adding any spins and what this is going to do is going to give me my wind angle and from there I know my wind angle my wind strength and I'll know what um, tweaks that I need to add to get a better chance at the hole in one. So wind angles, what I'm looking at is most of them are based on this tree right here, kinda. So if we are in the tree or just left of the tree in so if you see this little bush in the background, right behind the tree, that's kind of what I'm looking at, the left edge of that. That's going to be my neutral angle. This is uh, actually headwind over here. And this would be tailwind over here. All right. So that's the basic three wind angles that I'm catching. So here I have the headwind angle, right? Eight point four wind. Now I don't drop this one. I have dropped this hole in one after everything was tweaked out. But so for the headwind angle with an eight point four wind, my recommendation is five top and one point two left. We're playing it with left curl so that the center line uh, is just outside 
touching the outside of the shot circle to the left, right, left curl, and then just before circle drop, OP. As you can see, I had not quite enough side spin there. I have adjusted that in the tweaks. Um, So it'll give you a better chance at a drop. But if you want all the rest of the tweaks, you can find those in the guide. The base shot, 4.8 top, 1.2 left. And then tweaks as needed. Um, to get the hole in one, you'll have to pay attention to wind angles. You'll have to, you know, change your top spin and side spin as needed. And or change your curl as needed. But that's going to give you a good start. You should be able to tweak it out from there. I'm using basically in the tailwind 4.8 top in the neutral 4.9 top and in the headwind 5 top and then you'll need to vary the side spin according to wind strength uh, from there so good luck everyone nice easy eagle for the whole first hole with a good shot at the hole in one so good luck I hope you all get the drop and we'll catch you on the next hole P3 plus 10% max is the adjustment. I know I didn't say that, but that's it. P3 plus 10 max, just before circle drop OP, right? Good luck.